Hello, Internet! Freeze be to God, and welcome back to Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. We're very close to finishing the Glitz Pit. We, pr I'm gonna finish it in this episode. I don't care how long it takes. It's gonna happen. First thing I want to do is go outside and buy me a hot dog. Because I have one hot dog, but I'm gonna need two for a side quest after this, uh, after I beat the world. So, might as well get him now. I think I only have one. Yep. I've also been getting a lot of hate mail from Sumba, a mysterious person, as well as a lot of weird instructions from another secret person. So, yeah, lots happening. Make sure you catch up on the episodes if you haven't already. Try to keep them um, around a half hour in length, maybe a little longer. Alrighty, full HP, cool. Reserve a match. Well, boy, howdy, Gonzalez! Your next opponent is ranked 1 in the Glitz Pit, the Koopanator! Now listen, son, in this battle, I want you to win BEFORE you take 20 HP of pain. This is gonna be hard. Our fans don't want to see a battered hero win by the skin of his teeth, son! Now get in there and show me some grit, pard! Oh, this is actually gonna be rather tricky. Because this is one tough fight. Alright. Better get- I <laughs> better get really good with the action commands, then. It's him. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Razor Blade Brigader. Yep, a fight to the finish with the Koopanator. Come on, Mario, let's get this over with. You, finally, I get a piece of you. Finally, we'll see who's truly stronger. Get yourselves ready to battle! So this guy, I'm not exaggerating, he's the toughest enemy in the game. At least, common enemy in the game. So, let's start by using Quake Hammer to flip him over, shall we? So you remember Koopa Tro- uh, Why is all the fog happening? So you remember Koopa Trolls from Paper Mario 1? Well, these are dark Koopa Trolls. That's a dark Koopa Troll. These guys just totally ooze with toughness, don't you think? Max HP is 25, attack is 5, and defense is 2. After it charges up power, its next attack will be devastating. Try to survive it. It's almost like those red eyes are there to warn you just how tough it is. Or maybe it just doesn't get much sleep. Alright. I just realized it's foggy, I should not have done that. Because of course I'm gonna miss if it's a powerful attack. And I'm gonna switch to Sid. So the key is just flip this guy over with Quake Hammer a lot. And now we're gonna charge up Sid. Because we haven't shown off Sid's main attack, and when it's coupled with charge, it's really good. One more turn, ought to do it. Seriously, two turns of charging will make Sid's main attack amazing. Ground Pound, we're gonna rapidly tap R. Press A right now, oh, never mind. And yeah, look at all that damage. Okay, we didn't take any damage from that battle. I forgot he couldn't attack when he was flipped over. We got ourselves a winner! The Great Gonzalez! <laughs> How'd that foretaste? Sorry for the background noise, my parents are vacuuming. Here's your fight money, Mr. Gonzalez. 15 coins! And now we're rank 1. We just have the Champions match to go! Dean, Dean, Dean! Mail call! Do you think it's our pal or the guy who hates us? Remove the great Gonzalez posters in the lobby from X- No! Those coaster posters are great! From X this time, huh? The guy still sounds like a nut, but hey, he's all we got! What's he want us to do again? Peel off your posters in the lobby? Sounds good to me. Let's hit the lobby. No! I want people to know how famous I am. Oh well. I wish you could open doors while riding the Yoshi. That would make it a lot simpler. 
Oh, wow! Mario got famous! Well, we gotta use Flurry to get these posters off, so... And, if you do it right... Never mind, I thought you could pull both of them off at the same time. Oh, no. There are more posters up here, though. Hey, dude. Freelance cameraman here! You know, Rockhawk spends, like, days in the bathroom. I don't know what he does in there, but I do know this. I need a scoop like that. <laughs> I'm so glad I talked to you, man. Ooh, storeroom key. Dibs. Storage key! Whoa! Where do you think that key goes? I bet we're about to find out. Go to the second floor of the storage room from X. Oh, yep, that answers it for us. <laughs> Hi-ho, Yoshi, go! Nice. I wonder what lies up here. Well, it's a good thing we got the Yoshi. We would not be able to do this without him. Get this out of the way. Whoa! You gotta be kidding me! Bandy Andy and King K? What? Gun, gun, Gonzalez, listen to me. Ugh, man, don't get near the rain when no one is around. Oh. Andy, stay with us, okay? What do you mean, don't get near the rain? Well, that just got ominous. Aw, oh, poor King K, what happened here? Bandy Andy looks terrible! Who could have done this? Busted. Whoa! Did you see that, Mario? Was that Jolene? What the heck is going on? Caught in the act! Well... Jolene reveals her true colors, eh? And now to, now to compliment that, now we get to go fight Rock Hawk! <laughs> oh, better replenish that FP. We're probably gonna need it. Alright. Reserve a match. Well, the great Gonzalez! Howdy! Fix him for a fight, huh? Yuck, 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 yuck! Well, guess what? Your next match is the title match! Hooey! Darn tootin', you're up against the champ, Rockhawk! Now, I wanna see a fair and exciting match, so don't you let me down now, you hear? Now, listen, son, in this battle, I want you to use at least one special move, okay? The crowd needs something flashy. You catch my drift? Give him a good show! Now get in there and blow the roof off, son! That'll always be the fight conditions for this uh, one. It'll always be use at least one special move. Gonzalez, match time. Come with me. What's it like knowing you're so close to the top, huh? Don't get a big head, baby. Alright. I won't. Hey, where do you think you're going, pal? Huh? The ring's this way. Yeah, uh, you go this way this time, because it's a special match. Slow down, will you, buddy? Why are we going this weird way again? Ugh, this is the other minor league locker room. You two wait here. But this is a minor league locker room! And speaking of which, where is everybody? 
I know he said to wait here, but Mario, we're going to miss our fight against the champ. Now for today's main event, the top dog of the Major League, the Great Gonzalez, is finally going to throw down with the champ, this one, the only Rock Hawk! First to enter the ring, the Feral Nuclear Reactor, Rock Hawk! You go, champ! Rock him! Eee! You rock, man! Who doggies? Champ, how are you feeling, son? Your challenger's a handful. He don't want a handful of this. Uh-uh, there's only one champ, and it's me. Even if this Gonzalez wuss ever shows up, what's he gonna do, huh? Nothing. But the great Gonzalez made it to the top of the majors faster than anyone, ever. He even got up there faster than you did, champ. What do I gotta say about that? What do I have to say about that? <laughs> That's what... Who cares what this guy did to a bunch of chumps? Cause now he gets rocked! <laughs> oh man, the trash talking's already starting. Okay, they are like totally ridiculously late now. I'm gonna find out what's up. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Mario! It's locked! The door's locked! We're totally trapped! Yep. <laughs> That's not good. And now, for our challenger, the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez! Hold the phone, folks. What the hay's going on? What happened to the Great Gonzalez? <laughs> I'll tell you what happened. He fears the rock! Hooey! What a stupefying development, folks! Did the Great Gonzalez really turn yellow and red for the hills like a dog? I tell you what, folks, if he don't show soon, he's gonna forfeit the match! Oh, this is not good. <laughs> of course, we could always just try again later, but... Mario, if we don't do something soon, we're gonna forfeit that match! We gotta get out of here! Yeah, why the heck is nobody here? That always, uh... I never really understood that. I can't access the other Game Boy Advance, oh no. Oh, um, who put up the photo... Uh, who put up the Princess Peach photo? That's a little creepy. And there's just a TV in? Okay, this is weird. <laughs> Forgot about that. Nice little shortcut for the locker room. That's pretty cool. This is the uh, major league for the enemy side. Pretty nice, pretty nice. And guess what? The bathroom's not occupied here. Sweet! Well, you know about the man-eating toilet? Well... Yep, that happened. <laughs> Everyone's like, I hear something weird. What the heck? The toilets are connected. That's a terrible idea. I should like to request that we never do that again. In any case, to the arena. Not you, Flurry, though. I'm getting out Goombella again. <laughs> I just like Flurry's reaction to that. You. Ahem. He's like, oh, sorry. Didn't mean to. The moment you've been waiting for, folks! The Great Gonzalez just entered the arena! Gonzalez! 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 Wow, looks like we actually made it! And listen to those cheeries, Mario! They love you! Come on, let's go put this oversized rooster in his place, huh? You rock, man! Yeah, you the plumber! Gonzalez! You're late! You're late! Yeah, not my fault, though. Just listen to this crowd who holler for the challenger, the Great Gonzalez! Will his hammer of hurt and harm be enough to rock the rock saw hawk socks? Now at long last, the battle to end all battles is here! Let's keep it clean, boys! Okay, Mario, this is it! A match with the champ! Let's destroy this guy! <laughs> you wimp should have stayed locked up, safe and sound! What? What are you saying? Don't tell me it was you who got that security guard to lock us up! 
You darn right I did! I also sent you that poison cake, suckers! That's what happens when you mess with me, baby! You meet the pain train! So you're the jerk that's been sending us mean emails about the Crystal Star! Huh? I have no idea what you're babbling about now! What's a Crystal Star? No, wait! I don't care! I may not play exactly fair, but I got skills, punks! And now you're about to meet them all, baby! Prepare to be ROCKED! Use at least one special move. Yep, it's time for the fight against Rockhawk and listen to that amazing music in the background. <laughs> Love Rockhawk's damage animation, it's awesome. Tattle on Rockhawk! That's Rockhawk! He flips, flaps, and slaps! That's what the book says. Max HP is 40, attack is free, and defense is 1. He's really good at aerial maneuvers, but other than that, he's pretty... meh. One thing you should know is that Rockhawk never fights above the board. Carelessness leads to lifelessness, you know. <laughs> he's a couch! You're electric? How the heck does that work? Let's swap to Sid. And we're starting up the charge in. Heh <laughs> Alright, well, we gotta... Let's use Clock Out again. I love Clock Out! And it'll be great against Rock Hawk. <laughs> He's like, hey, No, I don't want the bomb over here! Get it out of here! <laughs> oh, okay, he's just immune to that. Well, that counts! <laughs> yeah, ouch, man! Darn you, poison mushroom! Okay, as I was saying, if you press A right at the end here, you do a stylish move! And he's already almost out of HP. <laughs> Not too shabby! You're better than I thought! This might actually be fun! Don't get your head swelled, though, because you've got a ways to go! Check this out! Time to rock! <laughs> he is powerful. Normally, the Yoshi's uh, ground pound just deals one every time. Pretty powerful, though, considering he's only level one. Man, you're kind of annoying! How dare you turn Rock back onto the Hawk! <laughs> guess I should have taken care of you before the battle. I'm getting lazy, I guess. Well, since it's come down to this, I guess I got no choice but to... Ouch. That's a pretty good move, I must admit. Let's quite camera this guy. Of course. Come on, please hit him. The fog is so annoying. Yeah, take that rock hawk. No! I rock hawk, the champ with the undefeated master. I've lost to such losers. He only gave us 10 star points, though! What a rip! <laughs> yeah! Folks, I feel like my eyes just popped out of my head! We got ourselves a miracle! Technique versus technique! Raw power versus raw power! A clash of superhumans! Folks, this was truly, honestly, without question, no doubt, absolutely, the most legendary, amazing, improbable history-making bout of all time! And the victor of this match for the ages was the great Gonzalez! Congratulations, Gonzalez! You're the champion, son! Give him a hand, folks! The new Glitz Pit champ, the great Gonzalez! Godzawas! 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 Yeah! Godzawas! That was awesome. Well, you finally did it, son! Today's your first day as the new champ! Here's your belt! And you got a champion's belt! The champ's belt you earned when you beat Rock Hawk. Tell you what, I'm gonna go ahead and get you set up in the champ's room right away! Miss Jolene, be a peach and show Godzawas here the champion's room, okay? Absolutely, sir. Well then, Mr. Champion, would you follow me, please? <laughs> oh, Grubba, hamming it up as usual.
Mario's like, gee, could we walk slower than this? <laughs> oh, yeah. Congratulations again, Mr. Champion. From now on, this is where you'll stay. It's your room now, so make yourself at home. You will use the terminal now, as you always have, of course. Will there be anything else? Well then, have a nice day, Mr. Champion. Yeah, I know what you did. Yeah, 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 yeah! We finally made it, Gonzalez, but... You know, Rock Hawk really sounded clueless about the Crystal Star. We still don't have any leads on that fiend. I mean, where the heck could it be? Hang on, Gonzalez. Do you hear that? A voice is coming from somewhere. You think it's a ghost? <laughs> hey! Do you have to have that thing turned up? It scared me silly. Find the ghost in the champ's room from X. There's actually a ghost in here? Okay, that is not cool. Ghosts are scary. Well, first thing we're going to do is take a sleep in this deluxe wooden bed. That honestly looks very uncomfortable, but... At least the comforters look nice. <laughs> how, how quickly did they get that poster made? <laughs> Grub is like, look, I know Gonzalez is going to be the champion. Might as well get it made sooner rather than later. <laughs> So now that we're up here... Actually... This is the champ's room! Yeah, this has to be like the worst decorating ever! Like that tiger print bed? I mean, come on! Think Rockhawk designed it? Or maybe Grubba? It wouldn't be Jolene. Oh, that's not wood, that's... Just tiger print sheets. Okay, that looks a bit more comfortable then. Well... <laughs> yeah. Gutters mean nothing to me. This is the air duct, right? Where does it lead to? Yuck, 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 yuck! Well, that's in perfect condition, as usual! Yep, once I got that baby working for me, this old bod ain't never gonna get weak. But I'm gonna have to watch my tootsies here for a little bit. First, I let that King K jit walk in on me when I was with that. And now I can't shake the feeling that Jolene and Gonzalez are onto me. Well, I guess I'll burn that bridge when the time comes. I'll just disappear them. Yep, just like I did to them others. Like I did to Prince Mush, the first champ. That's Grubba! You think he could have made all those fighters disappear? I better lock this room up tighter than a peanut butter jar at a squirrel convention. And I'll just go ahead and hide the paper relating to that in the desk drawer. There we go. You know what, though? Since I'm thinking aloud here, good fighters ain't nothing to mess with. Even Rock Hawk lost to Gonzalez. This new champ might have to disappear pretty soon, for my sake. Well, that's an unexpected twist. I liked Grubba. Looks like he's gone. Didn't he say something about his desk drawer? Well, there's a star piece back there. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> Thank you, man. Stuck on the couch. There's something! You think that's the paper Grubba hid? Let's take a peek, huh? Whoa! A machine under the ring using a crystal star? These are the blueprints! I don't know much about that technical stuff, but I think that crystal star powers it. If this document's accurate, then the machine can suck the power out of people. Do you think that King K and Bandy Andy have been, like, drained? Great gallop and gulpets! How well in tarnation did you get in here, son? Well, slap me, call me Sassafras! You're staring at my secret paper, too! Quiet, you total scumbag! You suck the life out of poor King K and Bandy Andy! Whoa, Nelly! This ain't good! Come on, Mario! We can't let that jerk get away! Darn tootin'. The security guard's just like, oh, yeah, uh, that happened. <laughs> just gonna make a save, just in case. Let's do this. I gotta say, y'all are a couple slack-jawed idiots sniffing around my business. Now you know my big secret, I'm afraid you're gonna have to take a little old dirt nap. Love this music. 
a shame it's only used at this part of the game. Look, Mario! Up there! The real Crystal Star! Yuck, 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 yuck! How you like my machine? Pretty dang nice, huh? Yep, I've been sucking power from fighters with this baby! Slurp! You're darn tootin', and you know why? Cause it keeps my bod forever young, son! Using a Crystal Star to look good? You're so totally vain! You're gonna pay for that! I'll just shut your traps now! I'll use my Crystal Star however I deign, please! Check this out! Mwah! up! Macho Grubba! Whoa! Grubba got huge! Hooey! I'm gonna smooch you guys into guacamole and snack on your energy too! Yep! Time for the real boss of the Gwitz Pit, Grubba. Macho! I'm a powerhouse now, you pestering little pieces of prairie piffle! So long as I got this here machine, my bot will be rough, tough, and ultra buff! Okay, Mario, I've just about had enough of this guy's yapping. Let's take him down. Can't flee this fight. So now we're fighting the boss of the Gwitz Pit, Macho Grubba. He's got really good stats, but he's actually not that bad. Make sure you tattle on this guy. That's Macho Grubba. He's Grubba all souped up on Crystal Power Star Power. Max HP is 60, attack is 4, and defense is 0. His attack pattern is simple. First he increases the number of times he can attack. Then he powers himself up with all sorts of crazy power-up-y moves. So it's pretty important to pay close attention to how he's powered himself up. The craziest thing about this muscle head is that he used to be that chubby Grubba. I guess the Crystal Stars are really powerful. more chances to attack are now available for him. I'm going to refrain from using the Yoshi in this battle just because he only has 10 HP and Grubba can deal a lot of damage. I am however going to charge up Goombella. Oh boy! Attack buff! And now his actual attack. Thank goodness for Zap Tap though, right? Underrated boss music here, too, as well. It's far from the best, but it's pretty good. This really feels like original Paper Mario boss music. Oh yeah! Keep it spicy! You know I love a good tussle, Gonzalez! Keep on scrapping, son! Of course it ain't gonna do you much good in the end! Oh no, not another attack buff. Can he deal, like, 10 damage now? No, okay. It only lasts one turn. No! Oh, thank you. Thank goodness. That is why the waterfalls are useful. Man, he loves giving him the attack buff. This is what I mean when I say he can deal a lot of damage. And Mario's still frozen. That's not good. Well, now that Goombella's super powered up, let's do multi-bonk. Oh, come on! The, the stylish move messed me up. Not too shabby, Gonzalez. You got showman's ship, and that's gold in this biz. But this here battle's just getting started. It's time I showed you some real moves. Back in the day, I had so many rump kicking moves, they had to make some illegal. Now he's even bigger. Ouch. Clockout's not gonna work on this guy either. Not in danger yet, but if he keeps up the how powerful attacks, then I will be. I think I'm gonna use a Thunderbolt. 
I got a lot of them. Oh my! That's not good. Shy guy. I'm gonna eat me... Fried egg. Shroomroast is really good. I don't really want to use that just yet. Arg! I ain't finished yet, Gonzalez! Ain't over till it's over! That's the way it goes in combat sports, son! And let me tell you something, Fortune's gonna smile on me in the end, punk! Not that again. That's low, jumping on my girl. You're gonna pay for that. Grab this harder than I remember. Oh, he made himself dodgy. I was wondering if he was going to do that. That means he can, might just dodge these attacks. Yep. He can also increase his defense, which he has not done. <laughs> well, that's enough. Yarg! Now that's the kind of star points I've been looking for. No! How'd this happen? How could a perfect bot like mine lose to such a chub? Oh, great, Gonzalez. Great fight there, son. Great fight. Ugh. Mr. Champion! No, I mean, Mario. Please allow me to offer my earnest thanks for defeating that foul grubba. Jolene! I really have to apologize. I'm so sorry that I had to get you involved. But you must understand, I had to learn the truth about the arena by any means. Let me tell you everything. I had a little brother once, by the name of Mush. He'd have done anything for me. Our family was always poor, so he became a fighter here to support all of us. But he suddenly went missing one day. Our family was inconsolable. I suspected foul play, so I got hired on as the manager and investigated in secret. As I looked for clues about my brother, I accidentally saw Mr. Grubba transform. Seeing what I was up against, I almost gave up hope. Then you arrived. So I decided to secretly guide you. So the mysterious ex who was sending me those emails? Correct. It was me. Once I saw you fight, I knew you were the only one who could challenge Grubba. Now, sir. No, not sir. Grubba. I want answers right now! What did you do with my precious little brother? You know exactly what I'm talking about. The first champion, Prince Mush. Ah, uh, Prince Mush, he... He discovered the secret of my power-sucking machine. I had him, ugh, disappear. Any which way you look at it, it... Oog, he ain't around these parts no more. No! I suspected as much. Oh, poor sweet Mush. You know, she came off all uppity, but she was just a girl who loved her brother. Whoa! Mario, check it out! The Crystal Star! Whoa! Is this... Am I back in the Glitz Pit? Mush! Oh! Is that really you, Six? What are you doing here? I... I was... I was just... There, there, Mush. It's okay. It's all over. Finally. Wow! The Crystal Star can do that?! Now, Mario, the Crystal Star is yours. Or was that Jolene who said that? It looked like Mush. Such a shame. I really liked Grubba. But him being the villain was a great twist. Wow, for real? We can just take it? It's better that you have it, so that nothing like this will ever happen again. Well, you heard her, Mario! Grab it! Oh, yeah. You got a crystal star, and your star power is now four, and Mario learns powerless.
Power Lift is not a very useful uh, power, in my personal opinion. But it's still decent. Glitzville see me underside was a dark, dangerous place seething with conspiracy. With the help of the lovely Miss Jolene, Mario revealed Grubba's true identity and acquired the third Crystal Star by defeating the monstrous Macho Grubba. Ma Grubba had used the power of the Crystal Star to run his power-draining machine. What other hidden powers might these strange and mystical items possess? Save all game progress up to this point? Yep, that's where we're going to leave the episode for today. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. Tune in next time. We'll deal with the Peach and Bowser scenes. And then we'll have some fun with some side quests. Have a great day, and God bless.